What is going on guys, this is Waffa here, and welcome back to some more Arc Genesis. Now, last time we left off, we were taming a big old tech rex. It wasn't this tech rex, but it was another one. And since last episode, I found another one, and this it's this one right here. This was a crazy one, you guys. I think it was like level 180 or something like that, whenever I found it. And of course, we've got the taming bonus on top of that. And then the baseline level became 269 after it got tamed. I, I actually think it might have had like a 99% taming bonus, actually, now that I think about it. Uh, it might have been lower, I don't know, I wasn't paying too much attention to it, I just slow-mo one trillion through it, but... <laughs> we're up to 300, level 313 right there, 32 levels uh, put on melee damage, and 12 levels put on health right there. Yeah, his, his health baseline is amazing, you guys. I can go up to 25,000 health with only 12 levels right there. I think it had like 8,000 or something like that beforehand, that was amazing. Uh, I just got done spamming food into his inventory to make sure he actually gets up to full health, that 25,000 right there. And then also, what I did between this episode and last episode was I made three more Rex saddles, and I've since upgraded them to Ascendant level, which took like almost pretty much all of our resources. I think I'm actually out of either hide or fiber or something like that. Uh, yeah, we still have a little bit of hide. Actually, we still have a little bit of fiber too. What in the world? Uh, oh yeah, I was trying to upgrade this thing. Yeah, and he'll say, yeah, I didn't have enough uh, metal ingots and, and spend a pace. That's why we uh, didn't have enough stuff right there. But yeah, this is the Magmasaur saddle. I did get some comments from you guys saying, hey, why don't you bring the Magmasaur? It's got that amazing AoE attack. And when we get surrounded by all those, uh, I forget what they were called, but like avatar, like player avatars and dino tars or whatever. <laughs> when we get surrounded by all those, it'd be amazing to just use some of the metal ingots. Do we have metal ingots here? Uh, yeah, we still have a lot of, geez, like a mixture of, like, scrap metal and regular metal, so that's good. But yeah, just grab some of those and we could use it with the Magmasaur. Uh, I don't know, I don't remember if I upgraded I think I upgraded it once or something, but, you know, it, it just costs so much more resources. I don't think I'm going to do it anymore, unfortunately. But hey, the Rex Saddles over here, they're a little bit cheaper to, uh, to upgrade. Pretty much just hide fiber and, like, is that it? Just hide and fiber? Maybe some metal or something like that? I don't know. Either way, it just took like pretty much all of our hide and fiber. We have just a little bit left over there. You know, just a few thousand now. <laughs> and then I came over here to the augmentation station, uh, made a bunch of uh, armor augments, and then got them all to about equal. So 251.9 and 256.9, 252.9 and 261.9. I did not know they were all .9 there. That's kind of crazy. Was that like a gas price? <laughs> Anyways, yeah, so now I've got cryopods over here. Which was the highest? Actually, you know what? Which one? Yeah, this one right here. I'm going to have to do some training with these guys. I actually did some training with, like, one other Rex off camera while looking for that Rex in the background. Uh, so, I, oh, I think that was the one I tamed at the end of the last episode. Yeah, so that's good. So that one's already at, like, 20,000 health. It might be that one, actually. Or maybe it's that one. I don't know. Uh, yeah, this one's at 20,000 health. Half half health. This one's full health. It's got 1,000% melee damage. This one has basically 1,000% melee damage right there. So we have two of them basically done right there. This one and this one need to have some level ups. This one only has 10,000 health, and it's not even fully healed. This one only has 7,800, so yeah, that one. You know, I'm going to, I'm going to bring that one out. I'm going to give it one of these, uh, actually, you know what? Since that's the lowest level one, I'll give it this side over here. This one's maxed out 325. Uh, this one can have the 251.9, because of how heckin' high level it is, right? Sheesh. Oh, this one's kind of green. I didn't notice that. Let me, uh... Oh, I didn't even give him the saddle yet. Jeez. Oh, he has 18 level ups. Ooh. Might have been either because he was in the cryopod, because I th think either you have to be in the cryopod or you have to be in the cryo fridge, but you get like double the uh, passive XP gain or whatever while you're in the cryopod. And I did a lot of slow-mo, like, passing, like, time and all that kind of stuff, so I wouldn't be surprised if all these level ups were from <laughs> literally just sitting around doing nothing. Yeah, he only has 2,000 XP right there, so I'm not too surprised by that. This gives melee damage up. It's going to make it a little bit easier to kill stuff, and then health is already, like, like it's below what the maximum is right there, you know? So I don't think it's really worth uh, upgrading that, at least for right now. Let me just put- oh! Oh, I like zoomed in on his like thigh right there. <laughs> let me- let me uh- Oh, you know what? Yeah, going in the volcano. It'll be risky, but you know, there's a lot of enemies inside there, and I do need to get a lot of chitin as well. I spent all my chitin to make cement base and uh, more polymer to get those uh, armor augment things. So yeah, I need to go kill some more stuff to get a bunch of uh, chitin. So hey, you know what? Two birds with one stone. Let me head back inside the volcano real quick. Level this guy up until he's uh, about 20,000 health, maybe 25,000 health at about 1,000% uh, melee damage right there. And then I'm going to do it to this other one over here. Yes, that one right there. This one only has 10,000 health. 
and uh, 400% melee, so a little bit, uh, should be a little bit easier for that one. And that one may have some level ups as well, just like this one did, uh, whenever I get him out of the crab pot, so may not need to do too much work like I did with that one. But for right now, let me just kill a bunch of random stuff in the volcano and get this guy leveled up, as well as that other guy leveled up. And when we come back, we're definitely going to be doing the Gamma boss battle again with five Rexes and one Magmasaur. Let's see how different that's going to be, because last time, remember, it was just me and my Rex. Now we're going to be taking five Rexes and I'm going to be on a Magmasaur, so let's see how much more effective that's going to be. All right, guys, I am back. All of my Rexes are now at about 20,000 health minimum, and then also like a thousand percent melee damage as well, minimum, so that's good. Basil is getting attacked by something, but hey, he'll, he'll take care of it. Let me get on my Magmasaur, and then I guess we'll get, yep, there we go, there's all five Rexes right there. Actually, I guess I could just put my Basilisk up inside of a Cryopod real quick. Hold on, let's go do that. That way we don't have to like move everyone away or anything like that, so that'll be pretty easy. Let's put them up inside of Cryopod, boom. I need to check in my armor, see how my armor's doing. I haven't been looking at that. Oh yeah, and then I think I, did I switch? Uh... Yeah, I, st I, I have the Riot uh, chest piece on right now because I wanted the extra carry weight during all that stuff, so either way, let's go put them up inside of the chest. Well, you know what? Eh, you know, I guess I'll put them up in the chest. Like, I might die during this and this doesn't even matter anyways, but whatever. Uh, there you go. So let's put that up right there. Let's switch out our tech armor. There we go. Perfect. And everything else seems to be doing fine. Armor... It's... It's got some durability to it. It doesn't need to be, like, full durability or anything like that, right? So let's go over here. Let's get on the magma sword now. Oh, yeah. Uh, I need to get some metal ingots for this guy so we can actually oh and then i need to go get some more ambergris let's go get some of that as well i think we have like 30 or something like that over here in storage so let's go grab all of it just so we can actually heal oh and by the way one of my rex has actually laid a tech rex egg of course that's unfertilized so it's not able to like hatch into anything unfortunately so let's just get ourselves some metal ingots whoops metal ingots like actual straight up metal ingots. yeah here we go we got all 635 of those boom keep those in his inventory hopefully it doesn't teleport out because it, it, it seems to every time that uh like one of these guys has metal it just teleports out of his inventory for some reason man I'm trying to talk to helena and keeps like floating away from me there you go arrival protocol final test gamma boom all right nice let's get on our uh, magma sore even though uh hold on hold on hold on that one over there i need to write hold on is this going to cancel if i i think so yeah, I think that canceled right there. Okay, well, I just needed to bring him over here. That way, I won't, you know, miss out on anyone. I think he was outside of the teleportation bubble, so let's just make sure that he's inside. All right, Helena, let's do it this time. Uh, arrival protocol, final test forward. gamma. All right. Oh, you know what? Let me do a save like right now. There you go. In case it, in case it fails, we could uh, do some more preparations like from this point on. So there you go. We got we got a. Oh, there's like no music playing this time for some reason. Either way, we're teleporting in like 50 seconds apparently. Golly, that's taking forever. Here we go. Oh, we're teleporting. All right. Oh, man. Ah, oh, man. I just realized. Teleport. Right there at the very end. Kill the corrupted. Uh, oh, man. I'm glitched inside of this guy. Hold on. Set to. Uh, there you go. And you know what? Set to aggressive mode, too. So there you go. So they're set to follow me, and they're also aggressive right now, too. What in the world? Test survivor. Everything we did prepared us for this. Man, I, I can't move. Some recent edits in this part of the simulation. Welcome to the final test. Oh my god. The final moments of life. Struggle if you wish, but your failure is inevitable. I saw that guy's face reveal for a split second before that, like, thing get on his head. Either way, we got stuff over here, so... There you go, let's just... Uh, all my tech, all my Rexes are set to aggressive mode right now, which is good. We've got one random player right there we can take down, hopefully. And we got drones up in the sky as well. Okay, there's a code key right there. Can I pick that up? Or do I have to actually be... I think I might have to be dismounted. Hold on. So how do I... So what do I do? Do I just walk into it? Okay, I do have two of them right now. I guess I actually have to pick them up. Rather than... Oh my god, the frame rate's taking a huge hit right now, you guys. Oh my gosh. I can kill that drone as well. Drone's being really annoying. There's like three of them here. Come on. There you go. That one's dead. Yeah, they don't have that much health, which is good. How my Rex is doing? Oh, wait. Oh, we got a lot of stuff here. Hold on. Let's get a magma spit going. There's a lot of player avatars right there. Holy heck. Oh, my God. The frame rate is tanking hardcore. Down to 15 FPS. Holy. I'm getting searing spits ready, though. Hopefully do really good. Massive amounts of damage. There you go. Killed a bunch of stuff. We still have more heckin' drones here we have to worry about. Are you kidding me? All right, let me get more of these code keys. There you go. There's a lot of them here. 
11, 13. And, uh, I don't know. I'm getting I'm getting a lot of them right now. 20, 22, 21. I uh, might as well kill these drones while I'm here, too. There you go. Get them with the shotgun, because I could at least hit multiple targets with this, which is good. Man, there's still more code keys over there. Kind of sucks you have to be on foot to pick it up, but at the same time, kind of makes sense, too. All my, uh, all my Rexes are... Oh, wait, what are those? I don't know what those things are. But all my Rexes are over here fighting stuff, which is good. Hopefully defending us. I want to go see what's, uh, happening over here. Oh, there's some code keys over here, too. Man, I'm stuck. These guys are glitched inside of me. What is this stuff, though? Oh, it's... Wait, what? Attack... Oh, wait, what is... Element randomly? I'm picking up element. All right, well, let's get the, uh... I will, I will! I'm trying to kill that stuff, though. The, uh, the dumb tech drones. Oh my god! I double-clicked, uh, E, and then it, like, changed my vision right there, unfortunately. Either way, we have more players here we need to take care of. I'm not, I'm not gonna worry about the element down there. I, I'm glad that I know what that is now, though, so that's good. I don't have to worry about being, like, distracted or whatever. Hold on, how'd I do that? Space? Uh, no. Hold on, how'd I do it last time? I forget. C? Yeah, sees how you explode in every direction. That's good, that's good, nice. I know. Corrupted avatars, we gotta beat them, but... We're at 36 keys right now. I, I can pick up a few keys right here, which is good, but... These drones, oh my gosh, they never stop! I'm getting hit, though. I need to watch out for that. I, am I even taking damage from that? What? A lot of code keys over here, though. I'm taking all these. Don't mind if I do. I probably get my magma sword to fall. Oh my gosh. I'll probably get my magma sword to follow me. Three quite awesome. I'll try and kill that. Oh, nice. Kill him. That's good. Up to 60 out of 80. There's so many code keys around here, you guys. Those drones are actually doing, like, no damage to me. What? That's good, but... Oh, man. Something's happening over there. A few code keys. Oh, wait. Hold on. We may have enough. Like, it seems like the, uh, little, little beacon for the code keys to say, to say hey, there's a code key right there. It doesn't show... Oh, wait. Hold on. Players right there. You know, I might get him with a shotgun, although I do need to reload on this. I'm getting slowed down as I'm reloading, though. Oh my god, a lot of players and stuff behind me. Oh! I'm getting hit. I'm getting hit. Get on the Magnusaur. Oh, hold on. Code keys. Code keys. Code keys right here. My tech and tech rexes are turning around behind me to hopefully defend. That's good. Up to 78 of these. Nice. Okay, where are the players at? There's one. There we go. Swipe at him with my sword. Maxed out sword. Oh my god, there's a lot of code keys up there. Okay, let's get on our Magnusaur. Is this it? Look at all those code keys! Oh my gosh, there's a thousand of them up there! What? Holy! Let's grab all of them, Hata. Gotta dismount to get them, though, unfortunately. Boom. Nice. Alright, we got all of them. Key drive full, deposit your keys. Okay. Let's go deposit them all. We only have two. Oh my gosh! Are we about to do it? Is this actually all you have to do? Like, this is a weird battle. Just get all the keys and then boom. That's enough keys. I'll start hacking at the Oh, do we have to... Defend enemies while Helen is hacking. The weird, like, mask guy. Oh, jeez. We take it all of our animals. What in the world? What was that? What is that? What is happening? Going up against a giant floating head. I altered the entire simulation for a new purpose. To find worthy servants who will appreciate the new world I'll make. But you're too rebellious, and thus, unworthy. So are we doing the same- oh, I think we're doing the same thing. Too rebellious? Mate, you haven't seen anything yet. Yeah, you ain't seen nothing yet, Ada. 80 more code keys we gotta get you guys. Alright, well, let's turn around. Got a lot of stuff that spawned behind us, it looks like they're, they're catching up with us. Definitely need- oh wait, hold on, yeah, it looks like a lot of stuff up there, hold on. And they're still teleporting right now. Let me get a good old steering spit going. Still like right up next to us. Boom. Big hit right there. Man, my tech rexes are still doing quite well. I need to get the, uh, let's get the spyglass back out. So how many stages are there for this? We're on stage two right now. There's gotta be some code. Yeah, I already see a few code keys back there, which is good. Oh, whoops. We're zooming in hardcore with a steering spit charge. We get them right there? I don't know, but we caught one of the drones on fire, which is good. Oh, wait. Oh, more of them behind us. These tech rexes? What are these? Corrupted Dinotar. Ooh, interesting. Can't hit this guy though. I need to turn around, but I'm stuck in my own neck and Oh! Turn around, turn around. There you go. Man, there's a lot going on back there. Thankfully, oh, oh my gosh, these dumb hecking things. Can I at least hit him with my uh Oh, thank you! Killing him with my my Magma Sword here, perfect. 
Oh, that misses, though, but I still able to do a good amount of damage. Oh, my gosh. Look at all those code keys. Perfect. Let's go grab them all. Uh, I, uh, you know what? I need to... Oh, I should have got more medical brews. I'm only down to 60 now, which sucks, but hopefully we're good. I should really get my magma sword to follow me. I'm grabbing them. I'm grabbing them, Ada. I have no jetpack or anything like that, so I'm moving on my feet on my own right now. Thankfully, those heckin' drone things above me do, like, actually no damage, which is good. Hopefully, they can do something about them. Where's my mag? There he is right there. Yeah, my magma sword set to, uh, the passive, so I'm gonna have to get on him. I'm gonna have to feel- hold on. Oh my god, there's a lot of Rexes behind us. We need to kill. I don't know if- oh my god. Spyglass is zooming in for some reason. Ah, uh, you know what? We're at, we're at tw yeah, I know. There are so many keys around here, I'm sure. Yep, there are more keys right there. What? Oh, Savage. Why didn't Helena save you, whoever that was, right? I'm like, I saved her at the end of Extinction, right? Or whatever that was. I don't even know what happened there. <laughs> she, like, ascended into the heavens. It was crazy. Let's see if we can get these uh, attack drones now. Got him, or at least a pretty good amount of them. I'm trying to aim. Oh, here we go. This is a good angle. Got him again. Nice. Nice. Let's get another one there. Hopefully my Tech Rexes are holding up pretty well back there. I think so. Yeah, I'm going to get a uh, Searing Spit over there to hopefully help them out, but... I need to dismount right now and pick up a bunch of code keys. Hold on, you follow me. And uh, I'm going to set everyone to uh, aggressive mode. So there it goes. So hopefully my mag sword can help out a little bit. But I need to be on the ground picking up code keys. We're about halfway. We're at 40. And uh, you know what? Back on the mag sword. There you go. Where are the code? Oh my god, a lot of code keys right there. Perfect. Let me help out uh, these guys on this side. I don't know if that actually helped anyone right there. But I need to dismount. Boom. Get over here, and you know what? I can get on my Rexes, too. I, I, I don't want to forget. I can get on them. My Magma Sword can definitely hold his own. If anything, I just need to keep an eye on his health, because I can heal him up if need be. Oh, there you go. Got that guy with the shotgun. Holy heck. We're at uh, 68 out of... Oh, my God. Whoa! A lot of stuff happening right now. Am I, on I am on fire. I think it's because of my Magma Sword, actually. I should probably get on him. <laughs> there you go. Let's try and hit... Oh, my God. Look at all those uh, keys over there. Those code keys. I, I don't even think... I need the, uh, the Deodons, you guys. Like, I don't know how much health my, uh, my, my, my Rexes have, but they have about 20,000 each. One of them has 25k. Oh my god, I, 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 we just need to kill those things over there. Try and secure a path to those code, code keys. Here we go. Well, well, my Rexes are pretty close. I can take care of them. That's good. Let's go down here and get some more food. Get some water. Key drive full. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, we must have picked up a lot right there. All right, let's go. Once again, about another five minutes. To get all those code keys right there, so nothing too crazy. That's great, nice. It does look like there's a third area over there because we got rid of like one platform. Let's go over here. Let's do the code breaker meme. There we go. Go get them there, Magnosaur. Go, Helena. Go. I'll start hacking at the teleport. All right. Look at that face. Disgusting looking. I need to get my yeah. My Magnosaur has to follow me, and he's still attacking all over the place. Oh my god, he's caught me on fire. Oh. Nice, we're teleporting again. Perfect. Another hit on that giant floating head. Oh, face reveal. What was that, Thanos? I'm Thanos. Fake Thanos. Look at him. Your creator, Helena, did not foresee my involvement, but she should have. She knew me quite well, and she was always underestimating me. I look forward to telling her you failed. What? I'm, I'm about to beat you. What do you mean, failed? Do you know anything about Helena? You should know that she sticks by your friends, and so do I. Are you like the same person? Like, I know you're HLNA and all, but, uh, looks like these guys are spawning in over here, which is good. Okay, yeah, they're, they spawn in, like, literally, like, right there, so maybe I can, uh, get some of these going and aim them down before they can actually get to me, but I just need to kind of turn around. I don't really have that good a turning radius with this guy, unfortunately. I can get a steering spit over there, though, which is good. Ah, uh, you know what? Well, thankfully my Rexes are coming over here, which is awesome. Let me see. How do I do it? Yep, there's some code keys right there, which is good. Just get a steering spit in every direction, just because why not? <laughs> there you go. A few code keys right there. Awesome. Let me dismount. Let me go grab them real quick. Uh, oh, my shotgun's fully loaded right now. That's good. I don't need to worry about that. And uh, my, my, my Rex should be able to take care of that guy back there. That's good. I'm still doing pretty well on health myself. That's awesome. 
actually kind of surprised I'm not like, well, I, 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 the only thing that I'll just take damage from, honestly, like the attack drones were actually doing like no damage to us. Like I was getting burned up by my own heckin' magma sword. So that's like the thing that did the most damage. I need to kill more of these uh, player avatar guys though. Cause how many there are, they all, oh, and these are player mounted. Yeah, you can barely see there are uh, players on them and there's heckin' attack drones behind, like all over the place on Bobas. I need, to, I need to get a good angle and try and get him with the, uh, the Searing Spit. I wonder if he could fall off this, you guys. That'd be crazy. Let's see if I can get him with... What? How do I... Can I aim up there? No, I can't. Man, yeah, this angle's not good at getting those heckin' drones. Literally a big flock of drones right there. Let's see if I can get them. Can't see. Oh, nice. I got a lot of them right there. Nice. Speaking of a lot, there is a lot of uh, code keys, like, right there, you guys. Let's get them. Boom. Let's go down there. Let's go pick them all up. Basically just walk into him and I pick it up. That's good. Getting up to 20 right there. Nice. That's a pretty sizable amount. Oh, wait, a lot, a lot of code keys up here. Whoa. Oh, wait, hold on. Got a lot of critters up here, too. Trying to get that Rex at least do some good initial damage. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are my uh, Rexes and stuff? I don't know, Bruce. I think we might start getting outnumbered here pretty soon, you guys. There's a lot of stuff right now. Like, there's a lot. Oh, my God. Gigantosaur, hold on, hold on, we need to... Oh no, did I... Oh wait, I have I have the stuff over here, that's good. How about the heck I fell off the map? Gigantosaur is over here. I need to get on my... Near my Rexes, they're gonna help me. They're gonna help me make sure I can die from the Gigantosaurus. Hold on. Gotta heal him up, gotta heal him up. Boom. Okay, that's all of our, uh, whatever you call it, it's right there, so... I can't, I can't heal him up anymore, unfortunately. Where's that Gigantosaurus at? Oh my god, my whole screen! <laughs> this is awesome! Hold on, let's dismount. I think the Gigantic Horse is down, which is good. Take some... I'm, oh my god, I'm getting constantly hit by these dumb tack drones. Oh my god! Trike right there did, like, basically no damage to us. Nice. Oh, I can't see. I'm picking them up. Like, my whole screen gets filled up with, with attack drone attacks, which is fine, because they do basically no damage to us. We're at the halfway mark right now. But the T-Rex right there, if I can kill him. Oh, nice, I actually got him right there, that's good. The players over there, avatars we need to watch out for, but... Am I getting hit by him? I think I'm getting hit by their, like, spears and stuff like that. They're doing, like, basically no damage. Let me get my sword out, swipe at him a little bit. I can barely see what's happening. There you go, nice, picking up a lot of code keys, up to 54. Still doing pretty well on this health right now, though. Hold on, I can't see. There's so many drones here. Can, can anyone kill these Ekin drones? Let me get on this. Can this Rex reach these guys? Nah, they're above a man. All right, I guess we have to get on. Let's get on the Magma Sword again so I can actually heck and see. Oh my God, look at all those key, code keys over there. Holy heck. Yeah, let's go over here, especially because there's a lot of my Rexes are over here. They're kind of defending the area, you know? Especially, oh uh, yeah, it's, it's, this is like where they spawn in too. There you go. Kill those uh, corrupted avatars. Kill this Rex. I don't know how much health these guys have. But if, if my Rexes all survive, holy heck, they're going to have such a good level, you guys. Oh my gosh. Let's dismount, grab all these keys. This might actually be enough. Like, looking at all this stuff right here. Oh, oh, I'm getting pushed around, it looks like. A lot of corrupted avatars, which are the players, which is good, getting killed right now. Because I think every corrupted, like, every creature we kill drops a code key. I might be wrong, but maybe it's only the players that drop it. But either way, still getting a lot of them right now, which is good. Man, ah. Where in the world's my, my magma sword's all the way over there. Hopefully he's fine. There are heaps of keys on the ground. Pick them up and take I really just want to get on the magma sword and, and, and aim at the, that big thing of, oh my god. You know what? Did someone just hit the magma sword? Just kill it. Or uh, kill, the, kill the big flock of drones. I'm so flustered, you guys. I need only three more keys. Kill this guy. There we go. Got him right there. Shotgun. Hold on. How are we doing over here? Just this one? Boom, got him, point heckin' blank. Is that it? Boom, that's all the keys right there. Let me get on the Magma Sword now. I think we did it, you guys. Then again, remember, this is Gamma. We do more damage, take less damage. That's probably why we're taking actually no damage from the heckin' attack drones right there. You know what? Before I do it, we need to kill those attack drones. Boom. Oh, well, that was only three right there? What? Okay, whatever. You know what? Kill this dumb player here. Then let's go get Helena. Did I kill him? No, I don't think it did. Still like three, four drones right there. Let's dismount. And let's go. Let's go put all the keys in. Boom, hell and I go. I'll start hacking at the teleport. Where are we going to go? This is like the end. I don't know. We're doing well in health. I don't know how this guy's doing. You ready? Where are we teleporting though? It's like the last platform. 
Oh! Face reveal. Look at that fake Thanos. Surrender now, and I may be merciful. But keep challenging me, and I may unplug this entire simulation. Oh my gosh. What are we doing now? Oh, I'm on his platform. Uh-oh. I need to get... I can only carry 20 keys at a time. And I needed to get 40 keys deposited this time. What is that? A, is that a Reaper there? I think there are Reapers coming out of the ground. Oh my god, he's got like lasers as well. Hold on. I need to pick up those, those code keys, but... I might just wait until there's a lot of like dead critters that drop the code keys. Need to watch out for his uh his lasers and stuff like that. I, I'm like I doubt if I kill those heckin' attack. Oh nice, there's a player over there. Oh there's gigantosaurus up there. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I see some code keys on the ground already. Nice. Oh there's a reaper up there. I don't know if I got it. I keep glitching through that like floating head and hologram thing. <laughs> there you go. Kill these guys. Do some damage. There's some code keys down there we can get. As long as we turn around, we should be able to take those attack drones down, but... I know, I'm, I'm going to go get them. I'm going to go get the code keys right now. Boom. Hopefully we're, uh... Yeah, we're still taking, like, basically, no, literally, like, no damage right now, which is good. I don't know what he just did right there. Some splash attack or something? I don't know. But we're at, uh, eight code keys. That's all right. Nine code keys. About at the halfway point here in just a moment. Yeah, it seems like most of the... Code keys are there in the middle. Yeah, this is a simulation. Surely you can hack it, right? A lot more code keys over here. Perfect. This might actually be enough to get the uh, the first deposit done. Like, we're going to go deposit and then, like, that empties my inventory, I bet. And I'm getting killed by these dumb attack drones. Man. Come on. A couple more keys there. Let me see if I can kill that Rex. There you go. I don't know what that was right there. Was I reloading? I don't know. A lot of players right there I'm shooting at. Key drive full. Deposit the keys. All right. Oh, oh, oh. A lot of uh, player towers right here, though. I'm getting overwhelmed. I'm getting overwhelmed. I'm getting overwhelmed. Get on my Magma Sword. There you go. Magma Sword's getting pretty low himself. We need to watch out. There's a lot going on here, you guys. My Magma Sword might go down. There is a lot there. What? There you go. A lot of stuff just went down right there. Oh, oh, lasers. Did my Magma Sword die? No, no. I got dismounted. I got dismounted. Hold on, hold on. Code breakers over there. I can't even see. What is happening? My Rex just gl I just glitch. I just glitch. Fly. I just glitch through the ground. Oh God! What in the world? Why is it? Why is this flying like super fast? There you go. Where's my Rex? Like in the ground though. He's in the ground. What? Look at all these players. Oh my God. This is like impossible. Look at all that. Look at all that. I'm gonna die. No! Oh my gosh! What was that trash? What was all that trash at the end with me glitching through the ground and that? I don't know what's happening right now. All my stuff just died. I could have deposited those keys. Yo, what in the world was that? <laughs> like, we got overwhelmed with all those players there, you guys. Like, to the point, like, it was, like, pushing our, like, characters through the ground or something. I don't know. Simple bed. I think uh, our dead body like landed here because I think whenever you're in that dimension or whatever, it like spits you out. Like where you teleported. That's all right. Go bouncing back. Is my dead body like right here? Oh, there's <laughs> oh, there it is right there. <laughs> and of course, all of our exes are dead too. Yeah, some of our armor died there in that. I might actually switch over to like the the riot chest piece and stuff. Like if I the the tech chest piece was like almost broken. Like when we left, the uh, same with the gauntlets. I'm, I, I might as well get some riot gauntlets and stuff like that. Well, that was a really good attempt there, though, you guys. Like we had all the, we just had to deposit those keys and then get 20 more. Like if we get the Deodons, which we're definitely going to have to do like next episode or something like that. I don't think we're going to need more. Like just get the Deodons, that heals all of us up. There's a nice support. I don't know how many I'll get, like three, four, five, maybe I get five. Maybe I'll get like six. That way there's like, like one Deodon per critter, you know, we have five Rexes, one Magmazor. That sounds good, and of course I, I might need to go back to the winter biome and make more of those uh, medical brews, because I was using up a lot of those, because I, you know, take some damage, especially over time, just want to heal up, yeah, especially during that last bit, too. If I want to heal up, make sure I'll die like I did right there, but, like, pretty much everything started dying right there at the end with all those, uh, like, player towers and stuff like that that we're going up against, but 
for right now, I guess I can end off the episode right here. Uh, we did make a save right before I teleported, so of course, uh, we could just load that in next episode and then, you know, go tame a few Daedons and then bring them along for the ride and give them some saddles, give them a bunch of meat, because they need, uh, meat to, like, be a fuel for them to do their healing and all that kind of jazz. Uh, but we have tons of meat here already, so I don't have to worry about that at all. Uh, then... I don't know, like, in there, is the tech armor really the best? Like, do I need the tech armor? I might just get my riot, or, like, flak or something like that. Like, whatever has the most armor. Yeah, look at the flak over here. This all has, like, 1,300, 900, 1,100, 1,900 right there. I know some of my tech is, like, 900 or something like that, right? Like, the helm, or, uh, helmets and, like, leggings or boots or something like that. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, the helmet's 1260, 990 for the, for that. These are 720 there, so, eh, we'll gain a little bit of, uh, a little bit of armor rating if we switch over to the riot. But maybe, maybe I'll have both. Maybe I'll have the riot and the tech and just kind of switch them whenever they get low and stuff like that just to make sure they don't break. But either way, that's just for next episode whenever uh, we come back with some more Art Genesis. I guess I can end this episode off right here. That was a really good attempt there, you guys. We got really close to beating it there, and we didn't even have any support. I completely, like, right when we teleported, I remembered, oh, we should have got the Daedons. So if we're that close without support, we're probably going to do a next episode with support, you guys. And like I said, I'll probably get, like, I don't know, six Daedons, five or six Daedons or something like that. Uh, next episode, I'll probably just film me, you know, taming like, I don't know, one or two, depending on how many we find. I don't even know if it depends, like, it, it matters what level we get. Usually, Daedons are pretty tanky themselves already. So maybe we'll just get, like, some level 100s or something like that. And maybe maybe even lower, depending on what we find. Because it is the bog, it's the easy biome. I doubt anything high-level spawns over there anyways, but I guess we'll find out next episode. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Look at those abs. <laughs> you guys jealous? Look at those abs right there. Six pack on that Thanos abs. <laughs> be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to hit that bell so YouTube sends you a notification every time I upload a video so you never miss one. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some... <laughs> Look at Thanos completely naked with a beard and stuff. I'll see you guys here next time with some more Art Genesis, where it seems like we're going to finally beat this final test Gamma, and maybe it'll be the final episode of Genesis before we move on to Valgaro, and then, you know, just wait for Genesis Part 2. But I guess we'll have to tune in next episode to find out. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Arc Genesis. Oh, bye there.